Uh, if you look here, we have the earbuds inside the transparent veneer, just like we had for the Air One case. And the red dot on the earbud still means it's the right earbud. And then at the top here, we have the charging port in this nice red. So let's take out the earbuds. As you can see here, ear stick is half in it, which means it doesn't have that kind of protruding silicon tip. Whereas Air One, as you can see, is in ear. So the reason for this is it's really a matter of personal preference. In-ears aren't for everyone, especially if your ear canal is like on the smaller side like mine. It can be quite uncomfortable to wear it all day because it kind of sometimes feels a bit tight or a bit like it digs in. Whereas half in-ear, because it doesn't have that little tip, is just by its nature more comfortable and you can wear it longer without feeling them. And that's really what we try to do with the design is make something that you could wear all day and not feel them. And these kind of do just that. So the design process was all about balancing comfort with aesthetic while preventing sound leakage, because obviously these are half in it. And actually, Ear Stick is lighter than Ear One. And these might seem kind of like teeny tiny changes and you might not think it adds up to much, but it just contributes to the overall feeling of like comfort and weightlessness. And like the, I guess just the fact that you can wear them all day and to get there, the team spent a lot of time meticulously making tiny curvature changes to the bud with each iteration. And then to make sure it works universally on as many different people as possible, they 3D printed over 200 prototypes just to test on users from across the world, all with different ear canal shapes and like sizes to make sure they work for everyone. Okay, so we're talking about earbuds. So obviously it's time to talk about the sound. EarStick is our most advanced audio experience yet. The sound really is exceptional. It would also be exceptional if you subscribed to this channel, but it's easy to say the audio is amazing, but actually there's a lot of thought that goes behind every single component to get that quality. And I think when you use something every day like earbuds, you kind of forget that and you just take for granted that it magically works. And so for me, it was really fascinating learning directly from the product team all the rationale behind everything that we did. So for example, they told me that the thing they focused on the most with sound was getting the highest quality speaker driver possible. So if you don't know, the speaker driver is the most important part of sound because it's the thing that emits noise. So it lives inside the head of the earbuds and it's made up of the magnet and the diaphragm. To show you better, we've prepared an earbud in advance that we've cut open just so we can show you this little component. So this is really cool. So as you can see here, this round thing is the speaker and it's made up of the magnet, which makes the diaphragm, which is this part, vibrate. And that creates the sounds we hear. For EarStick, because it's naturally half in ear, we wanted to go with a bigger driver to compensate for the fact that it's half in ear. And that's because bigger drivers usually means better sound quality as it produces stronger waves. But some of the bigger drivers, especially the off-the-shelf stuff other brands use, make the overall earbuds bigger and heavier and therefore less comfortable. So that just doesn't work for what we're trying to do here. So we decided to customize our own. What we've ended up with is a 12.6 millimeter custom driver that's one of the most sensitive in the market. And what that means, it, it can amplify really tiny details and deliver really powerful, authentic sound, all with minimal distortion. And there's a couple of things we did to get it to this kind of level. So the first thing we did was we used the highest grade magnets on the market, and that's responsible for creating a hi-fi sound quality. And then the second thing is we applied this custom coating on the diaphragm. So you can see here, this is black, but actually this used to be like a metallic silver and the custom coating strengthens the overall diaphragm and prevents it from warping at extreme frequencies. So like really high frequencies or really low bass. And that's usually what causes that like annoying tinny noise you get sometimes with other earbuds. So this combined with the magnet creates those really clear highs and deep lows really like punchy bass, all with minimal distortion. Okay, so speaking of bass, I know that some of you might be worried that because it's half in ear, you're gonna lose sound. And to be honest, so did I. But we added in something called Bass Lock, which is a software that 
detects how much sound is leaking out of your ears as you wear the earbuds, and then it retunes the equalizer curve to the optimal level every time. So that way it locks in bass and it stays consistent and rich. Okay, so I know some of you prefer heavy bass. So you can actually tune your sound to put more emphasis on that in the completely customizable equalizer settings we've created for EarStick. I think some of you were asking for this after we released Ear One, so the product team have gone ahead and done it. So I can show you here. It's in this cool little interface that we designed. And when I say we, I obviously mean not me, the design team. So in device details, you have equalizer settings. And if you see here is this cool little interface. Okay, so here you have treble, which means higher frequency, mid and then bass. And then you just move these little arms around, which is very like, cute. And then you can map out exactly how much of each frequency you want to hear. So it's very personalized to your kind of liking. And then you can customize and map out exactly where you want the emphasis. So if you want more bass, more treble, more mid. And then voice here means, well, clearer voice. Actually, I'm going to show you guys how you access this later on. So stay tuned. We feel a sound, but that's not the only important part of earbuds. The other is connectivity and stability. And what I mean by that is you rely on your earbuds every single day to get you through the day. Especially in the last two years, we're all just spending so much more time calling people online, whether that's your loved ones, whether it's work related, we're all spending a lot more time relying on audio products like earbuds. So it's really important that if I'm on a call in my living room on my laptop, I should be able to go to the kitchen without it disconnecting. That's pretty obvious. So we've made sure that EarStick has maximum connection stability. And the way that we did it is by basically redesigning the antenna. Okay, so let me show you. In Ear 1, the antenna is lower down the stem here, which is closer to the face. So for EarStick, we moved it up. So now it's above the gesture controls and further away from the face. And that means the signal is stronger because there's nothing blocking it. And obviously, as part of connectivity, it's got to pair perfectly with phone one. You just, you twist it open, like that, and then you press and hold the top pairing button with your phone, and then it's connected.